Hello Pisces, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly weekend reading for the weekend of March 1st, 2019. The cards I'm using today are Wild Unknown Tarot by Kim Cranes. I want to thank everybody for like, share, subscribing and setting up personal readings with me. Alright guys, let's get this show on the road. Alright, what's going on with the Pisces? Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, here. So it seems like somebody has a choice to make. This could be a choice between jobs, a choice between people, a choice between a person and a job, okay? All right, so we got the death card reverse here. This makes me feel like somebody may be in a toxic situation and they don't want to let it go, okay? Or somebody doesn't want to let you go. All right, somebody's emotionally exhausted with the whole thing. Why am I here? Why am I doing this? But it seems like somebody is holding you back or you're holding somebody else back. Or you could be possibly holding yourself back, okay? But I feel like somebody's getting toward the end. All right, so we got the Six of Wands, I mean, Six of Swords reversed. This makes me feel like somebody's getting ready to move back somewhere. So it could be moving back from their family. I mean, back to their family, moving back to their friends, wherever they were before. This also could mean somebody just don't want to move forward with this situation, okay? This could be somebody also like, okay, uh, somebody got a business trip and they don't want to go there because they're sick of the job, okay? But it seems like somebody's sick of something and they're ready to quit, okay? I see. All right, so we got the Father of Swords reversed. Yes, I feel like somebody's definitely sick of a job, okay? Um, I feel like somebody's analyzing the situation. I feel like somebody is never right here. Never right. And it's horrible. It is very exhausting to be in a situation. Like, even if you're right, you're wrong, okay? So, like, you can have all the answers right, and they just look for that one little thing that's wrong just to blow it up in your face. Nothing that you did was good is, is, is good enough, okay? All right, so we got the Seven of Pentacles. Oh, goodness. So somebody's working their little heart out. Somebody's doing the best that they can, and it's just your best is just not good enough with this person, okay? And somebody's just waiting to see, like, you know, what I feel like today. Somebody walks into somewhere. It could be a house. could be um, a business, like, every day ready to, ready to leave, you know, because they're getting beat up emotionally. But it seems like... You know, when you ready to quit, they can see it and they try to hold you back, okay? It's just like whatever's best for them is the best thing to do. Mm. All right, so yeah, seems like somebody's leaving, okay? We got the Eight of Swords here. Seems like somebody is realizing that they're not trapped. They just stuck in this situation. They're not stuck in this situation. They're just there because they want to be. But I do feel like somebody's getting ready to start um, looking for ways out, okay? Wow. Okay, yes, a lot of manipulation going on here with this bad boss or bad partner, whatever it is. I do feel like there's, um, of course, negative energy with this devil. And then I also feel like there may be drug or alcohol abuse, mental or physical abuse. When I said that earlier here, so it could be physical abuse going on, not just mental. All right. So it seems like you 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 realizing that you got somewhere to go. You might be starting out from ground zero, but um, it's better than being mentally abused daily. All right. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.